What's up, everybody? Jason here for JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. 2022 Tops Triple Threads Baseball 9 Box Inner Case Break. Picky Teams number 3 just sold out. And again, guys, fresh Master Case. So we had a little RMB for a couple teams there. So you'll notice everybody else bought in straight up. Is everybody there? And then here's the customers in the RMB with their numbers assigned to them. So here we go, guys. So numero tres. All right, so fresh master case, guys. So we're gonna cut open the case. We'll see which inner we'll use for this break. Next one will be for number four, which has already done a 10. So most likely have to random number block. The next one, I mean, unless nothing crazy is pulled here then can always uh, sell it out straight up like we did number two. And tape is missing there. I don't know, it's coming off. One, two, three for the left, four, five, six for the right. And it is a six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So this over here will be for number four. As you can see, number four right there. Horrible writing, but it's four. Let's rock and roll, guys. All right, Mariano Rivera to 299 with a Manny Machado to 159. Bobby Witt Jr., Ty Cobb. We got a Gavin Sheets triple relic auto to 75. Chicago White Sox with a Buster Posey to 36. San Francisco Giants, that's going to Greg. Garrett Cole, Bryson Stott to 259 and 299. Triple Relic, Mariano Rivera, Derek Jeter, and Andy Pettit, 35 out of 36 for the Yankees. And hold on, I want to make sure I didn't miss any. Garrett Cole was a Yankee, actually. That's 58 going to Chad Cromwell. And then uh, Mariano Rivera was 101 going to Brian Tippett, spot one. And I think that's pretty much it. Okay. And now this one's going to go to 35, spot 5. 5 is Michael L. And then to 25 for the Colorado Rockies. Colorado Rockies. Oliver.
All right, Giancarlo Stan to two ninety nine with a out of one twenty five Bryson Stocks. And that's our third numbered Yankee. That's two seventy five spot five going to Michael. Wow. This one actually has three hits. So what do you know? Our first case had missing hits. Now this one has extra hits. That is Cal Rally to 35. Seattle Mariners, that is going to the RNB. 22, spot 2 going to Johan. We got a New York Yankees relic. That is 17 out of 18 of Giancarlo. 17, spot 7 going to Brandon. And then for the Cardinals, Dylan Carlson. And whoa, this card is kind of bent backwards right here. I don't know if you guys can see that. Error, error. Uh, that is Cardinals Josh. So I can send you like the wrapper or something if you want to get that one a little mess uh, fixed up there. Ozzy Smith to 299 and Pete Alonzo to 125. Cardinals and Mets. Triple Relic, Kershaw, Bueller, and Urias. Dodgers, Ed. And then we got Jaron Duran to 75. 57 out of 75, Patch Auto. Boston Red Sox, that's going to the random number block. Seven, going to Brandon. We got Frank Thomas for the White Sox. And another Giancarlo Stan, 252. Johan was bought two. Uh, did what freeze, Beast Snip? Am I, fro am I frozen? I'm looking at myself right now, break on YouTube. Maybe just refresh. Luis Patino. That's for the Tampa Bay Rays to 50. Tampa Bay Rays, that is straight up Alex. And a 27. Cars here. Did they really? Do you guys have control of who plays what out loud or at some point at night do you guys just take over the intercom and just like play music? Uh, Texas, that's going to add. Yeah, can you cut them down and start cutting down these ones? Wander Franco to 199. Uh, yes, but I need it. Oh, you can use Joe's. Here. I don't know how to open that. Dude, it's easy. Take it in. Dangerous. So somebody just has like a freaking fire playlist at some point and you're just like, damn, this is great. But, but like, do you guys have, like, a plugged-in MP3 player? Is it, like, a plugged-in CD? Or, like, a CD? Or 
Does Kroger have their own like Spotify playlist? <laughs> I don't understand. Uh, Wander Franco, Relic, 17 out of 36. And then we got George Kirby, rookie autograph card, Seattle Mariners. So again, that's automatically going to spot zero. Which zero is Alex. Kroger Radio? So I, I can literally go look up Kroger Radio on one of those, like, Streaming site, like streaming uh, platforms, and it'll pop up. That is awesome. You know, I'm not gonna lie, Rex, I am one of those guys. I'll go to like Target, whatever store I'm at, and sometimes they're playing music through the aisles. And I'm just like, oh wow, that sounds pretty good. Like, I like this alternative band, or I like this song. And I Shazam it every single time. So it's like, you know, I just. That's how I do it. Like, that's how I find new music, honestly. <laughs> I'm just like, wow, I can listen to this. So I wonder if all these companies just have somebody just looking through and playing, like, great songs or looking at fire playlists or fire songs that just came out. The 99 Mel Ott. That's New York Giants. And of course, Yachty, St. Louis Cardinals. Josh. Hey, -oh, how about a one of one? Chris Bryant. Bryant Blasts. Going to the Colorado Rockies. Oliver with his second one of one today. Man, he's not even watching these breaks. Can you believe that? There you go, man. And then Tyler Glass now to 50. And raises on Alex. You got Jose Ramirez, which is Guardian. 248, spot 8, going to Chad. And Ryan Sandberg, 6 out of 125. <laughs> I know, right? It's like, all right, Oliver's not here to claim his one on one. We're going to have to give it to the next customer. That's funny. Did you think, did you think, there, did you think that, uh, that uh, draft your pack was fun, Chad? Seem pretty fun, right? And we got to 27, 21 out of 27, Walker Bueller. Uh, Dodgers, Ed. And another Dodger for Ed, Cody Bellinger. Cody Bellinger. I, I, I love that. I mean, I was just hoping that filled earlier in the day, so that way we can do multiple, but I really feel like it's it's kind of like a fun way. Like, you love hit drafts the way we do them, you love the hit packs, this is just kind of like a hybrid. And honestly, it just, it really does give everybody the opportunity to still get a big hit. Like, you know, even that person that was second to last got the second highest hit, you know? So, I thought it was fun as hell. Uh, here you go. The buttons right here. I, I don't I'm going uh, to donate him uh, the little cubes that they give at Disneyland in your drinks. Oh, so with the yeah. The little lights. Um, I think Jason was saying, like, oh, you should drink For sure, for sure. Yeah, yeah. No, I mean, honestly, Chad, I mean, whenever you pop in and you want to give it a shot, I do have other customers that are willing to get into bigger breaks, but it's just kind of hard to always sell those. There's only so many people that would be into it, but. I have enough customers on Instagram that will definitely get into like a bigger hit pack run, bigger hit draft run. So, I mean, you just let me know, man. One of these days you pop in and, or like give me ahead of time. I can create one, man. Don't worry. Bogarts. Red Sox, that's going to spot eight, going to Chad. And Joey Votto.
Tony Gwynn, Biebs, and Julio. Seattle Mariners. So again, this will actually be randomized to everybody in the RMB because it's not numbered. So everybody will get a shot at that. We got Javi Baez. Oh, chat, trust me, dude. I mean, obviously those pandemic days and even last year days were obviously a lot different than now, but... Man, at one point, chat, I'm not even kidding you, dude. We were doing $2,000 a spot hit packs like we do now, those five $600 ones. I think even up until last year, but I, I remember specifically, like one, uh, I think it was like in November of 2020, I remember we charged... 2000 people wanted high end like crazy so we charged 2000 a hit pack the ceiling was like a $15,000 card and we dished out like you know $4,000 card 6 7 up to 10 but the highest prize was like uh 15,000 at the time obviously we're, it's a lot crazier it's a lot different now but that was like wild times man <laughs> all right we got a huge redemption coming up guys i didn't see who it was but I believe it's a huge deck though that has multiple names. So I think I'm going to save that to be last, to show that last of the break. But yeah, the, obviously market and everything is a little different now, but it was a wild time. I mean, everybody was using their stimulus checks. <laughs> All the pay they were getting. There were no gambling, no sports at the time. Wild. All right, four, which is Michael. Yeah, which is going to happen. It, it is. It, it, I'm, I'm happy that the market is correcting itself. I mean, you can tell now a lot of hobby boxes are dropping down in price. Which, again, it, it's good. It's going to correct itself. You know, obviously, if you were a guy that took advantage and sold all your stuff throughout the last couple years you made a shit ton of money probably right if you end up holding on to because you thought it was only going to go up and go up and go up might not be making just as much now but there's still ways to maximize your your investments into products but i think it's just flipping if that was the case you know like i mean obviously collecting some of these players that are you know potentially on the up and coming is always the best way you know but uh, like I said, I think the hobby is still strong. It's just with the with the pandemic, we just skipped a couple steps. You know, we, we skipped a couple floors. We were on our way up and then boom, just shot up. You know, just like anything else, just too much. And now it's kind of settling down. It's not still this. We wait, we passed what we were supposed to be. We're still up here, but it just kind of settled down and now it's slowly being what it's supposed to be as its way it was supposed to go. Sorry. <clears throat> But it's good though, it helps everybody out, you know. No, but I'm serious though, Chad. Everybody was using their stimulus check. Dude, at one point, people were making more money to stay home than they were uh, working, right? And remember, no gambling, no sports on. It's literally just. Just, uh, just breaking and at one point, Korean baseball. I remember we were so excited for Korean baseball like at 2 in the mornings. But the high-end stuff is still high-end and is really strong. Vladdy. To 150. And then Salvador Perez. Uh, JJ, this is pretty much our last break of the day. We've, we've been on since 2 o'clock Pacific, so 5 Eastern. So probably going to be filling more breaks tomorrow. George Springer. For the Blue Jays. Brandon. And Aurelius Chapman. Yankees. 
New York Yankees. That is part of the R&B. 81 going to Brian. Greg Maddox. And another Mario on reverse. That's like our third one already. 63 going to Chad. And how about a nice Joe Maurer? Four out of nine. Minnesota Twins. That is part of the random number block. Four going to Michael L. With the Giancarlo Stan, I feel like that's our second one as well. 47 out of 48. Spot 7 going to Brandon Hyde. A lot of Yankee hits so far. But again, the Yankees are one of the most priciest teams. Their checklist is super, super loaded. And I think Yankees hit like in both breaks in number 1 and 2. So it doesn't shock me. Ooh, this box feels really heavy. Jackie Robinson, uh, rings a bell, but not, I, like, I know, no, I think I might be familiar with him. Heard it or seen him. Matt Manning, to 75. Detroit Steve Herrick. And then we got Noah Syndergaard to 48. Angels RMB. That is 6, which is Chad. This box felt a little heavier, but maybe it's just me. Oh, yeah, if he hasn't been called up or anything like that, Rex, I mean, I'm sure you should hold on to most prospects, especially if they're like higher picks. Mark McGuire to 199 and Juan Soto. Yeah, um, I think most places, PSA, and I'm sure Becca does too. I haven't said anything in a while, but I think they prefer him to be in a, a card saver. Um, which is kind of like the old school ones where kind of just like, it's kind of like a hybrid top loader, but um, I'm sure you'll know what it is if you just look at the card. It's called card savers. But I believe they'll accept it in a top loader too. But yes, I mean, you still should send it with some protection. Um, I don't know if they'll accept it with like magnetics. I think they don't want you to send them like that, but I think top loaders are still fine. Whoa, what is this? Two of three. Look at that. Look at those relics, man. Is that a piece of the... Is that a piece of the base? It says game use memorabilia. Two of three. That is Reese Hoskins, Bryce Harper, and JT Realmuto. You guys see the dirt right there? That's why this box is heavy. This card is heavy. Philly's going to Josh. Very nice hit, man. Yes, I would say the thick cards don't put them in a card saver. Definitely still leave it in a top loader. Ian Anderson. Braves, John. Yes, that top loader is fine. I don't think it should be a problem. Alright guys, two more boxes. Yes, if if it's like a redemption from Panini, yeah, you don't yeah, you don't have to crack it open. I think they'll be willing to to open it themselves for that. 
I think in that instance. But, um... We got Mike Schmidt to 75. And then Jose Ramirez to 259. And that's Guardians, 224. Spot four is Michael... Tyler McGill. Mets. One of Jeremy to 99. And another Wander Franco relic. Nice. 15 out of 36. Spot 5 is Michael. Or actually, sorry. Alex about the raise. Straight up. Sorry. Mike Piazza to 2.99 and Will, Willie Mays. Fernando Tatis back to back, 35 out of 36 for the Padres. Ed, and it looks like guys. Um, maybe like I just said, it was just one of those cases in number one and two, but we were missing a ton of autos. So like I said, apologies on that. Obviously out of our control. We'll try to figure something out with tops and that. But, uh, like I said, it seems like every single box has had its normal two autos, two relics. And there was one box that actually had an extra hit. So I feel like that was, uh, kind of just a fluky case, which I'm sure... You know, they should be able to fix it and take care of it, but just just, just goes to show you, you know, it, it does happen. Errors do happen like that out of the hundreds of thousands of cases and boxes they make, you know, it's going to happen. The good thing, though, is that we caught this on camera, too, so I think that's the good, uh, good thing about it. You know, if you were ripping this personally at your home and think they'd be like, oh, I don't know, man, that seems a little suspicious. Nine? But... We caught it on video, so that's the good thing. Three on one side and six on the other. Jaron Duran, and then a Babe Ruth, 135, going to Michael. And then we have 20, zero, which is Alex. I think that last card is going to wow us, though, guys. That DECA, I want to say it's going to be a DECA. I've seen, like, multiple names, like a ton of them. I wish it was live, but I don't mind it being a redemption because we still pulled one. But I think the last one's going to be a banger. Jonathan India to 36. Uh, Reds going to Jeremy. And then we got Will Smith for the Dodgers. 36 out of 99. Another one for Ed. Alright, Milwaukee Brewers to 299. And Honus Wagner for Pittsburgh. Alright, then we got a Jose Altuve, 1 of 18. Houston Astros, gonna add. And a 27, Luis Castillo. Yeah, I think for the sake of a randomizer and heartbreak, I hope it is all one team, but <laughs> I don't know with some of these decks, they're wild. They could be a mix of teams, prospects, home runner, home run kings kind of deal. Alrighty guys, moment of truth. Let's see what this is. This is one of those crazy deck of books, I, I believe. Good luck guys, and uh, if I break your heart, don't take it personal. Woo! Alrighty. Triple Threads, Decca, Autograph, Relic, Book Combo card. 
of Oh my god, I think this might actually be all one team. Tim Anderson and Paul Konerko. Jose Abreu, Frank Thomas. Harold Barnes, Jim Tomei. Mark Burrell, Lou Bob, Luis Robert. Carlton Fisk, Tim Raines. The fact that I'm reading all these is amazing. My eyesight must be great. Wow. All Chicago White Sox. So again, Tim Anderson, Paul Canerco, Jose Abreu, Frank Thomas, Harold Baines, Jim Tomey, Mark Burrell, Lou Reese Roberts, Carlton Fisk, and Tim Raines. That is awesome. Again, very tiny text. <laughs> I had to like reread it again. But yes, it is all White Sox, so no randomizer needed. And Chicago White Sox, Patrick Davis. Congratulations, buddy. That should be pretty nice. Um, let me actually pull up the checklist. I kind of want to see what those are numbered to. Alright, so... Yeah, so they have a mixed one, right? Bly Levin, all those right there, deck of number one. This is deck of number s I don't even know what number this is, actually. But it's going to be this one here. Deck of number eight. That's the one it was right there. So these are number to ten. Unless it mentions it's gold, then that'll be out of five. And if it's ruby, that's a one of one. So that's the one we pulled there. But there is a lot of other ones, guys. Cardinals. Uh, there's a Shohei Otani. Well, this one would be massive. Imagine this one. Arenado, Shohei Otani, Tatis, Vladdy, Bobachetta, Cunha, Soto, Devers, Tucker, Luis, Robert, and Julio. That would be pretty nice. What about this one here? Deca number five. Vladdy, Otani, Judge, Soto, Pete Alonso, Ronald Acuna Jr., Christian Yelich, and uh, Bryce Harper with Nolan Arenado. This one's a Mike Trout, A-Rod, Jeter, Mariano Rivera. That is wild. Actually, sorry, the Mike Trout doesn't count. This is all Yankees, actually. But, yeah, some really nice ones there. Alrighty, guys. Well, there you go. That all goes to one customer there. And, again, a very, very solid um, break, though. Got the Deca. We did manage to get a lot of nice hits, though. Do a quick little recap. And again, we weren't missing any hits, so that's great. We got them all here. So that was perfect. We got actually an extra hit, too. Top it all off. This one was an amazing hit. A little Joe Maurer there, too, as well. Mackenzie was very nice. Bueller. One of one. And we did get a lot of hits, though. I will say, a lot of hits for the uh, RMB, and, and really a lot of numbered Yankee cards. I feel like we almost got every player. Show you guys this was all for the RMB. And then like I mentioned, a lot of numbered cards. Look at this. I feel like we got almost every Yankee. Alright, so yeah. Uh Eighteen, nineteen. So we got nineteen relics. Seventeen and eighteen autographs. So yeah, we got an extra hit. So there you go, guys. Pretty nice. So again, every case is different. Second house in the store, number four.
jazbeescasebreaks.com.